Hey, what's up guys, it's Darren here, back with another video. As you may see, this video is l uploaded a little bit later than the usuals, but yeah, life gets busy, life gets a little bit more fun, and opening packs sometimes. But we're now here, we're here to open some packs, to see what we get, and as always, we will be opening a Fusion Strike pack. From a very special someone. We are about 75% of the way through now and we've gotten some reasonable hits. Um, but I would love for one more big pull out of the rest of the packs. But we're only, only opening one of these every pack. So we will keep on keeping on. Alrighty. One, two, three, four cards to the front. Roll this around and let's get started with a Leaf Energy, a Judge card, an Excadrill, oh, a Trevenant, don't think I've seen this card before, very spooky in the woods, a Geodude, getting that tan on, fair enough, look at that sun, that's the shadow underneath him, and Sizzlipede, looking weird, fair enough, <laughs> we've got Klefki, definitely a dupe, I've seen this one a couple of times, ooh, Pansage, look at that art style, some of that water color vibe going on. Very Japanese, I feel, but we keep on keeping on. With a Wulu on its four. Um, not like the other one that is rolling around. And we keep on going with a ooh, a reverse of a judge card, which we saw as the first card of this pack. And the last card will be just a regular. Rare in a Claydol. Levitating, spinning, fast, rapid spin. Fair enough. Alrighty, let's put this card away to the side. And then four Crown Zenith packs. Let's see what we get. Last time we got some really good stuff. This is being from the shiny Sun Center box. Hopefully the luck continues. Still needing plenty of glaring gallery trainer cards and just glaring gallery cards in general actually. So yeah, let's get rid of this code card. Turn it around. Four cards. One, two, three, four cards. Swap it around. Flip it around. Fighting energy. A Matang. Very menacing. Fair enough. Very cool. Very cool. NG switch. A croc croc. I wonder what move it's using there. A poniard, not looking to be piercing anything really in that pose. Um, a cricketot, a shinx, reading a book. Could be doing a rear kick, fair enough. All right, we got a sunken. All right, in the meadows, very windy. Look at those turbines go in the back, and we get. Oh, we missed the mime. Okay, what are we getting next? All right, so reveal. Ooh, just a reverse in a Hooper. Fair enough. And the last card will be another reverse, 80. It is a Pangoro. Fair enough. All right, so this reverse will get a nice little sleeve. We've got three packs left. Let's see what we get. There you go. Hooper. We're done here. Hoping for a better card at the end. Next pack. Zemazenta and the Zation at the front of the artwork. Okay, I wish I could open that a little bit better. If you guys are still enjoying this video, I'm trying to upload two of these a week. Regular content, from what I've heard, is the best type of content. Alright, card away, cards out to the front. Okay, alrighty, let's see what we get. So with a fire energy. Okay, trekking shoes, very important. It's getting a little bit cold now, so I have my house slippers on. Not really trekking shoes, but you know, slippers, fair enough. All right, we've got a shaman. We've got a friend in his suey. Still haven't gotten the full art for this card, but we continue with a repeat cricketot. A repeat Shinx. Oh, didn't realize you know, it has some cookies on the side there. Very, very nice. 
Do you repeat a call every Mr. Mime? Okay. Bit of a trend. Okay, bit of a trend. <laughs> we continue with a coughing. Did we get that last time? I don't I don't believe so, but it does look very, very familiar. But the next card will be oh, just another reverse. Or in the enamorous actually. I think last time we got just the normal one, but now at least we got both the foil as well as the reverse hollow. So that's pretty cool. So I'll definitely get a sleeve. And the last card will be Ooh 54 has a star on it. What does that mean? Oh, it's a VMAX Zorora. Okay. That is a very cool card. All right, let's have a bit more of a closer look. That is textured to the max. VMAX. Very cool. Centering looks pretty good. Has it like on the back? Well, top down doesn't look the greatest, but overall, a very nice snazzy cup. Fair enough. 54. I definitely don't have this card, I don't think. I'd be happy with this to be you know, the best, but we've still got two more packs up, so let's hope that it might get replaced as the best card of this of this video. Okay, and the enamorous will go into its own little sleeve. It has a reverse there. Okay, we continue. Two more packs left. All right, let's see if I can open this a little bit easier. I'm not having the best luck with opening these. That's a good start. That's a very good start. All right. Let's get cracking. Okay. This is a little bit tight. Okay. Code card away. Cards out. One, two, three, four to the front. Front and back. Front and back. All right. Let's see. Darkness energy. Okay, trekking shoes again. Let's get it. Stay warm, guys. Lunar tone out. Oh, look at that. Soul Rock and the Lunar Tone back to back. We'd love to see that. It's a very cool little combo. Spinning attack. Very cool. We got a Pan Cham. Not really that menacing, but that Pangoro though looking very spooky. Alright, Snorrent. Looks like it's actually using a a um, ice move there, but like icy wind or something, but not quite. All right, we got a rock rough, howling to the moon. Tangela, one of my favorite cards. You know, you guys know what it is. That nice little raspberry at the top. Imagine that was that little cute cherubi. That'd be very cool. Next card. All right, we got bow toy. Okay, getting up to the good stuff now. Let's see what the next card will be. <gasps> Ooh, Galarian Gallery 12. Do I have this? I'm thinking, I'm hoping the answer is no. <laughs> we keep on going. Ooh, nice. All right. I definitely don't have this one. It is a Deoxys. With that nice little foil on the top. No texture, but that is a very cool looking card. Wow. That is awesome. All right. This, I'm not sure if it overtakes the Zorora, um, but... Very happy to have pulled this card. And the last card will be, okay, number 66. Is it the same as the Zoran? No, it's not. But I reckon this will be another VMAX card with that little star there. Slow reveal. Oh, Hatterene. Okay, Hatterene, VMAX. I think I may have already pulled this previously, but that is a very nice card to pull. And a double banger pack. Okay. Coming in with the goods. All right, let's put both of those into a nice little sleeve. Deoxys first. Still waiting for the other Deoxys card. That looks freaking insane. I think it's definitely the speed type Deoxys. That's a full art. Alrighty. But another VMAX card. Very, very chuffed with this. Let's put this one over here. And then we've got one pack left. One pack until the next video which uh, i think i'll be opening the last of the crown zenith products that i have at the moment it will be a shiny zation box with the promos click out of the way cuts out one two three four to the front let's get 
going with this last pack of this video. Hope you guys have enjoyed it. Alrighty, we start off with that leaf energy into a rare candy. Theron. Okay. Oh, friends and Sinnoh. Friends and Sinnoh, fair enough. Well, Cynthia's ambition would be a fantastic card to pull. Still waiting for that. And Mulga. E love disc. Okay, not too menacing. Fetch a tot. Very nice. A Yanma. It's a really passive looking Pokemon so far. Hopefully we can end on something a bit more exciting. Oh, I'm on here as well. Definitely something very, very passive. And we get... Oh, just a reverse in this pack. All right, we've got a Snorunt. Okie dokie. And the last card will be... Oh, just a regular rare in the Zorora that we got as the VMAX at the back there. So if you guys have enjoyed this video, don't forget to leave a like, hit the subscribe button, leave a comment down below if you were the first to watch this video. And until next time, have a good one.